Hi guys, David here, hope you're having a great training week so far and you're really hitting those goals. Coming to warmer months, it's even more important to drink lots of water. Now I'm going to give you some tips on why it's important to drink lots of water. Alright, number one, helps increase your energy levels as well as just relieves your fatigue. So if you don't drink enough water, you're going to fatigue a lot quicker. So it's going to affect on how you train. So it's very important throughout the day, during your training session, drink plenty of water. Number two, helps keep you cool. So our body's going to cool temperature, and obviously when it increases the heat in the day, your body temperature is going to rise, so you drink plenty of water just to control your, your body temperature throughout the day. So in a way, it's an inbuilt air conditioning for you, so keep drink plenty of water. Number three, promotes weight loss. Now, one thing when it comes to drinking lots of water, if we don't drink enough, what happens to our body, our blood sugar levels drop. Okay? So when it happens, is tendency, if we have blood sugar's lot, we actually feel hungry. But you're, you think you're hungry, but you actually are thirsty. So it's very important to keep drinking plenty of water throughout the day, just to control your hunger pains. All right, so it does, and also it keeps you nice and full, so you don't have a tendency to grab those little snacks in the middle of the day. All right, number four, helps flush out the toxins. So once you start drinking lots of water, it'll make you go to the toilet more. And by going to the toilet, it'll help flush those toxins out of your body. All right, number five, nice one for the ladies as well, helps your skin complexion. So it keeps, it, it keeps your skin nice and flush and fresh. Alright, and most, the most important thing is number six, helps carry option for your cells. So, more water, increased blood flow, helps you carry those cells so you get less fatigue and promotes health. Alright, so there's a couple of tips for you why it's important to drink lots of water. Now, a couple of tips also how you're not drinking enough water or measure how much water you're going. For example, what I normally use here throughout the day. It's one of these bottles called two liters per day. On the front here, you can't read it, but it's got little benchmarks throughout the day. So what time you fill it up, for example, it says six o'clock. Then throughout the day, it gives you little goals, block of your training, where you should, how much water you should have throughout the day. So for example, at 12, by 12 o'clock, I should have at least three quarters of a liter for the day. Now, if you can't afford something like this, what you could do is on an all water bottle, clear water bottle, with a pen, or to throw a texter, is write down a time and how many liters you have per day. And that gives you some goals to go by if you're drinking enough water. Hey, another way to measure if you're drinking or not drinking enough water is your body weight, because your body is made of majority of made of water, so it's very important to drink lots of water that way. So, good idea is first thing in the morning, get out in the morning and weigh yourself, especially good for people who do a lot of sports, or they're out in the heat throughout the day, but also just track your water intake. So you weigh yourself at the start of the day, and at the end of the day you weigh yourself again. Now, per se you've lost a kilo of water fluid throughout the day through sweat and through evaporation for your lungs. All right, so if you lost a litre, my guide is aim for intake of a litre and a half for the day to put back in your body. So it's hard to make sure you're not dehydrated. Okay, another indicator is your own urine. So first thing in the morning you wake up, if your urine's yellow, then you haven't drank enough water throughout the day, like from the day before, all right? So, but if your urine's clear, you find you already had drank enough water the day before. So good little tip, good routine to have in the morning. Get up, have a nice glass, or a cup of, uh, couple of cups of water, or a cup of water, it's up to you how much you want. Do that, have that before you have your breakfast. Get in a routine of doing that, okay? So there's a couple of tips on why it's important to drink water, but also good ways to help measure your intake throughout the day, all right? Have a great train day, and I'll talk to you soon. Have a great day.